Welcome back to the series on the top 11 updates to the 2020 Scrum Guide. Next up is the emphasis on one Scrum team with three accountabilities. The Scrum team consists of a product owner, a Scrum master, and developers. Previously, developers were referred to as the development team. So we had the development team within the Scrum team. This terminology was always awkward and confusing with many incorrectly referring to the development team as the Scrum team and leaving the Scrum Master and Product Owner as outsiders to the team. It diminished the notion of one team working together collaboratively to deliver value and instead created an us versus them behavior between developers and the product owner. The developers felt they were working for the product owner as opposed to collaborating with the product owner. The 2020 Scrum Guide addresses this misunderstanding by dropping the term development team and replacing it with just developers. So now it's just one team, one Scrum team, and the product owner, the Scrum Master, and the developers are all part of the same one team. Developers in this context, like before, do not refer to just coders or programmers, but to anyone working on product development activities. Furthermore, the 2020 Scrum Guide clarifies that the entire Scrum team is accountable for creating a valuable, useful increment every sprint, and now identifies three accountabilities for the Scrum team. Developers that are accountable for delivering a working, usable increment each sprint, a product owner that's accountable for maximizing the value of the product resulting from the work of the Scrum team, and the Scrum Master was accountable for the Scrum team's overall effectiveness. What do you think about this update? Add some notes in the comments and stay tuned for our next episode. Make sure to read the accompanying blog post for more detailed information, and don't forget to like and subscribe. See you soon.